Tonight, the race for president is already on. Nikki Haley is in New Hampshire holding a set of town halls just two days after she formally announced her candidacy for 2024. The former UN ambassador and South Carolina governor is the first to challenge ex-president Donald Trump for the Republican nomination. Haley says two years ago she wouldn't run against her former boss for the White House in the next election. But speaking in Exeter tonight, the 51 year old says the nation needs a generational change. I don't care if they underestimate me because that's always fun. They said I couldn't win when I ran up against a 30 year incumbent and I did. When I ran for governor, what I didn't tell you was I ran against a lieutenant governor, a congressman, an attorney general, and a state senator, and I was Nikki who? Nobody had heard of me. But we worked hard and we won. Now we asked Maine Republican Senator Susan Collins today what she thinks of Haley's run and if she'd support her. Here's what she had to say. Well, there are going to be many others that I expect will throw their hats into the ring. Uh, but I think very highly of Nikki Haley. I know her personally. She's very bright. She now has foreign policy experience as well as executive experience as a governor of South Carolina. My friend and colleague, uh, Tim Scott, also from South Carolina, is about to begin a listening tour across the United States. He may well run. Uh, so I think we're going to have some really good choices. But alternatives to President Trump, you wouldn't support former President Trump running again? I, I do not. Haley plans to speak at St. Anselm's College's New Hampshire Institute of Politics in Manchester tomorrow.